What up, what up, what up? What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Your boy, welcome back to another Madden 25 Online Ranked Match. And today, we are the Indianapolis Colts going up against the Philadelphia Eagles. Definitely a team that I hate to go against. So, this is actually uh, my first time going up against somebody in the top 100. He was 100 on the dot. And of course, I didn't notice this until the game was over. I'm ranked like 2,800 or something like that. So how I got matched up with this guy, I don't know. Maybe there wasn't that many people on. <laughs> I don't know, but I was live streaming this. And um, link is in the description for that. Also, I got my shirt today, man. I'm excited. It, it came in looking good. Came in looking good, man. So um, all the price. Bringing the lumber. That design is just off the hook. And that's it just, it just says it all. You don't even, even got to say nothing. When you see yourself. A fine, pretty young thing. You go up to her, you don't say nothing. She, she just sees your chest like, oh, that young gentleman is bringing the lumber. So it came in today, man. I thought it was very, very successful with the product that came in. I'm very excited. And uh, actually sold a couple. I actually sold the onesie, which I was amped about. Somebody bought a, uh, I'm bringing the lumber onesie. Uh, sold some iPhone cases and whatnot, man. So um, it, it's been doing pretty okay. You know what I mean? So, uh. That link is in the description. I spent about a, a six-hour update the other day, so go on ahead and check that out. We got, you know, new load prices. We got uh, new phones and cases and water mugs and T-shirts and sweater dogs and tampons and mouse pads, all that stuff, man. Go on ahead and check it out, man. Go on, it's a fumble, but the ground caused it, and technically, legally, the ground connect caused a fumble. So check out the description for the t-shirt shop, man. Go on ahead and get your GS certified approved t-shirt. Like I said, I got mines in today. I can't wear it. After this comment, I'm just going to go outside right now and just, just look for a pretty young thing. I'm just going to be looking for a pretty young thing to say something too. <laughs> but I'm going to say about this game, man. It didn't take me long to know that this guy knew what he was doing. You know what I mean? Right now, like I said, I'm ranked uh, like 4,000th or 2,000th or something like that. So, um, you know, the, the skill level I'm going up against, it's definitely getting better and better. You know, my opponents are getting a little tougher. But this guy, I knew right away, like, okay, he's he's good. He's he's good. I can't just tell. Like I said, he was ranked 100th on the dot when this game started. So, uh, he, holds up, he holds us to a field goal right there. So, uh, definitely uh, something we didn't want. You know what I mean? Uh, <clears throat> my defense isn't good enough. For me to rely on field goals, you know what I mean? I need touchdowns, and I need touchdowns, and I need them now. You know what I mean? My defense isn't good enough to provide me enough stops for me to survive off of field goals. So, you know, anytime I have to settle for a field goal, it's always a frustrating thing. So hopefully, maybe my defense can come through right. Don't test the user. He is so disrespectful. Somebody, please not allow me to fumble and give up a scoop and score right there the very next play it's a fumble and he could go oh the way as the big man hits me with the dougie as he's going on to the end zone and he decides to go for two on the pitch because i went off sides on the p18 he succeeds man just as soon as the morale goes up and up and up it comes down 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 man user interception turns right into a scoop and score so that right there is definitely frustrating so 15 to 10 right here, man. Back on offense. Hopefully we can secure the football this time and uh, be able to drive downfield and get ourselves into the end zone. Now he does receive ball at halftime, so you know you got to be careful uh, in that type of situation, man. I definitely have to make sure I try my best to get the ball last. You know what I mean? Uh, if not, don't give him too much time to be able to drive downfield. Because like I said, uh, a 14-0 turnaround could be devastating. You know what I mean? Uh, he could score before halftime, get ball, score again. We don't want that. That's why getting ball to half is so key. You know what I mean? It's very, very important to me. Like, I hate getting the ball first. You know, when, when I don't receive ball at halftime, I just feel like I'm at a disadvantage. Don't ask me why. I just do. So, second and 14 after that sack, he decides to go to, uh, looks like a, a draw or dive, whatever it is, right up the middle. Uh, right here, Michael Vick throws an incompletion on fourth down right here. Not too many people can win consistently by playing special teams on fourth down. Like your boy GS made it to the top 100 numerous times. Punting and kicking field goals on fourth and inches. There's not too many people that can do the fourth down swag. Good play, good play call by him. I mean, statistically, I want to say the success rate on me on fourth down as he goes on ahead and converts two of them. And this one happens to go for a touchdown. I mean, fourth down has to be somewhere like around 70% or something like that. Like, 
man, when I see somebody go for it on fourth down, I just know what the outcome is going to be. I'm like, damn it. You know you're going to get this first down, man. Why are you going for it? <laughs> I hate. I don't know what it is, man. Just the, the clutch factor on fourth down is not there. Zero, zip, zilch, nada, any other different terms that describe zero. Uh, it's just very, very frustrating to, um, you know, stop somebody on three downs. Because for me, that's, that's difficult as it is. You know what I mean? I don't force too many fourths down as it is. But the few that I do, and they go for it and get it, it's 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 frustrating uh, defensively. That's why I feel like this should be a fair play lobby, man. I, I should, shouldn't I get the ball if I stop you three downs in a row? The same way you get the ball if you stop me three downs in a row? I'm just saying. I'm not saying much, but that's all that I'm saying. EA, y'all need to invite me to y'all studios because y'all got some explaining to do. Because I need to know why I can't get the ball if I stop them on three downs. That, 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 that's all I want to know. That's all I want to know. I just want an option. I just want an option to be able to get the ball if I stop you on three downs. You know what I'm saying? If I stop you on three downs, I want to be able to get the ball. That's all I'm saying. Because we all know I'm not stopping nobody on fourth down. You know that. I know that. We all know that. That's why they go for that fourth down. They know I'm not going to stop them. You know what I'm saying? So 24 to 27, we are down. And as I've stated previously, he does get ball at half. So we need to score. This has to be a scoring drive. Hopefully, we can run ahead and get into the end zone as Bradshaw takes a huge run up towards the right side. Uh, right here, we go to the tight end screen. My dumb self thought uh, Cody Fleener was starting. Wrong, wrong, wrong. It was Allen. Uh, Fleener might have taken that for a touchdown because Fleener got like, what, 90 speed, 80, 70. He, he's, I don't know what it is, but he's definitely a lot faster than whoever's starting a tight end. <coughs> right there, we end up taking a run towards the outside on the left side, and we end up scoring. So 27 to 31. He does get ball at half, so uh, hopefully we can go on ahead and stop him here. We all know how my defense is before half. My defense is... The awareness of an iPhone charger is ass. I don't know why, but I always give up scores before halftime. Hopefully, this isn't one of those uh, cases. So, right here, Michael Vick, he throws right over the middle for a big completion. He has uh, one timeout left after he calls that one. Right here, man, he, uh, he rolls outside the pocket and gets a good gain. I think it's like 12, 13 yards or something like that. And uh, inching his way close to the field goal range. So, right now, I'm hoping that that doesn't happen. Huge sack right there. Forces his last timeout. So, maybe we might survive. Not getting up a touchdown. Right there. I'm sorry, son, but news of you. Give me, give me, I don't stop the egg yet. Another Shimon. So right now, man, I do the dumb thing, right? I'm thinking, you know what? Let me go up for a tea bag. Let me go up. Let me throw it up to Bay. Bay got this. We throw up the alley oop. And Bay don't got this. He don't. Nope. Nope. He don't got it. We throw an interception. And uh, that right there sucked because we didn't even get a chance to kick a field goal. I thought maybe I could just. Toss it up there to Bay. He was going to come down with the snag. And I was going to throw like 17 catchphrases. And I'm going to say how I'm the man. How I did a teabag with 10 seconds left. Yeah, it didn't, it didn't quite work out that way. It didn't. Not at all. So he gets the ball back. Um, so hopefully we can go on ahead and uh, retain the lead. You know what I mean? So uh, he's got a very deadly team. A team that you got to be careful with when you're going up against so much speed everywhere. You know what I mean? So you got to be careful. I can't press. I refuse to. You know, unless I'm on mutt and I got a whole bunch of corners that can handle, you know what I mean? But uh, we got a um, couple speed backs, but, you know, with just Macklin and Jackson and McCoy and then you got Cooper in the slot and just speed all over and Vic. So I'd rather stay back, which uh, he's been taking advantage of with the comeback route. You know, he scored back-to-back -to -back touchdowns on back-to-back -to -back comeback route. So third and 11 right here, uh, he goes for the play action. Goes over towards uh, the left. Try to strip the ball loose for an incomplete pass, but that did not work. So, uh, as usual, I'm struggling on defense unless you decide to test the user. Somebody, please, give that gentleman a link to my channel. Let him know, do not throw the ball my way. Our second user interception. That's a three-piece. Uh, our third interception of the game. Our second user interception. So, right now, this right here will be huge. Third and 18. We look. We go towards the inside. And my main man, Hill, and got our back for the first down. That right there was absolutely huge. Also, really quickly, there are there was a couple people um, when I had uh, did the debut green opening of the t-shirt shop. There was a couple people said, like, yo, we need. Oh, right here. Look at the team bag, though. I thought it forever. Look at Hayward Bay going up and getting that. I was stunned that that happened. Stun inside joke. Whoop. Juke move. Eat some dirt, son. There's a couple people that requested some designs, like uh, eat some dirt design, and um, just let let you know, let you guys know these designs cost me hundreds <laughs> to get them done. So um, I will eventually get you know all of the dumb stuff that I say on shirts. Uh, right now we've got five. We've got don't test the user, um, no suit for you. Uh, I'm bringing the lumber. 
I can't even think of my own designs. What else do I got? There's two more that I can't think of right now. Uh, you know, you ain't saying nothing. I'll go check out right now. I just scored a touchdown. You ain't saying nothing. That's the power of the internet, baby. I'll just type in one word, bada boom, bada bing. Next thing you know, I'm there. Bam, t-shirt shot right over. Okay, we got don't test the user. It's the fumble. Give it to me, baby. I'm bringing the lumber. And most of you. All right, those right there are five designs, which I can't even think of because that's ADD, folks. Stay in school. And if you got ADD, take whatever it is that fixes it. I think it's Adderall. Uh, is that what it is? I don't know. Don't take it if you don't have ADD because I heard that stuff is addicting. But um, 38 to 35 right here. We do have the lead. He did go for two. He did make it a three-point game. So right now, I'm trying to chew as much time as possible and hopefully, you know, be successful in getting into the end zone. Right there, we barely get a first down. That right there was huge. So uh, like I was saying, the newest design that my designer is working on is uh, astronomically biblical. That right there was a design that I've seen uh, multiple people request. So uh, he's working on that, and he said he is going all out he said that this is going to be by far the best design he's probably ever created so i'm excited for that i think it's going to be i'm actually astronomically biblical so i think it's going to turn out for for an amazing shirt phone case toilet seat cover you know starburst pack holder oven mitt bibs whatever it is you want to use it on. i think it's going to be off the hook so right there i refuse to score a touchdown because i want to waste you know more timeouts because i see that uh, he's he's dipping into those timeouts so right here trying to waste as much time as possible i didn't mean to score here you know i just wanted to get down on the one to you know waste a little bit more time but you know it is what it is we do go up 10 he has no timeouts remaining so he's going to need a score and an onside kick in order for him to have any shot in this game so right now having a multiple possession lead though i could care less about this defensive possession he could score it doesn't matter all i care about is the onside kick if he doesn't get the onside he can't win so uh, of course, I want to stop him here. I would like to, but, you know, if I don't, you know, I'm not too worried about it. Four, four and 14. You know, I didn't realize so I was editing the video that he was coming out in, uh, I think it's wide receiver corners. Right here, he hits me with a wide receiver screen, takes it all the way to the end zone. Definitely call me napping. Uh, great play call by him. Just wasn't expecting that. Um, every time he came on a five wide, he hit me with the same corner route like four times in a row. Like, I should have picked up on that during the game. Right here, he tries to hit me with the quick squib before I could even audible out of wide receiver. I mean, uh on site so that right there is the end of the game guys we end up winning by four tough game like i said this game was live streamed twitch.tv slash mr golden sports stream every single day watch these games live man come out hang out buy a onesie come relax <laughs> so that's it man hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay love each and every single one of y'all but you already know this as always it's your boy gs man and i'm out peace